Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. We are in a, a different lobby today. I thought we'd actually go and head over to the 60 plus lobby since I don't think I've been in this lobby since it was actually released. I kind of forget about it and that's probably like the worst thing, but I do kind of forget about it and I kind of made my way on top of the tent. So I thought I'd also do that here because I thought it looked pretty cool up here, especially with everyone behind me. But yeah, this is a level 60 plus lobby if you weren't actually aware of it. And that is what the boat was used for in the main lobby. But um, today's video is going to be another challenge because we do not know when another update is coming for a dungeon quest at this point in time. I think Vinny and Joy are working very, very hard on it. And, ooh, this lighting though is like a perfect so that is cool but yeah since we don't have an update today we are going to be doing a challenge and that challenge is the no armor in samurai nightmare so we're just gonna jump straight into it today obviously to prove to you guys that i will not be wearing any armor whatsoever the cosmetic has to go I never thought I'd have to unequip the cosmetics because I like I do love the armor, but at the same time I love the armor cosmetics. It gives me such like a different variety because I love the mage armor. It actually looks amazing and probably one of my favorite armors in this game because it just looks so magical and so mystical and I'm just weird at this point. I love it, but at the same time, your girl here loves her beach girl outfit and her princess outfit and the banana outfit and every single outfit that she currently owns and she wears them all the time but um this armor is coming off because we're about to do a no armor challenge am i gonna be able to do it maybe this is not going to be in hardcore mode because i know i'm not gonna be able to do it on hardcore mode so goodbye plate goodbye helmet we are going full on noob mode today well other than the starter one challenge oh maybe i should do that as a challenge but uh we're just gonna jump straight into a game today because i don't want to miss out on what's actually going to happen i have my game ready so we're just gonna start it off attempt the challenge if we win we win if we get a legendary that's amazing if we lose we lose it's it's just part of life in this game. Especially when you grind this for like 10 hours a day and you still don't get a legendary for like over two weeks and you're like, ugh. Oh. Feels right in the feels at that part because I have been grinding this game so much to get more legendaries. It has not happened. Like the legendary that I actually have right now was given to me by someone else because they were leaving the game and they weren't playing it anymore because I had to focus on other stuff. But they gave it to me and it was amazing and I cannot thank them enough for that because this saved me because this is an 82k stuff. I was about to say, oh my god, my armor's gone, but that's the whole point of a no armor video. I'm crazy, okay? Okay, huh. we're not doing it backwards. We're not doing it first person yet. Yet, if I really want to challenge myself, I might do that in the future. But Samurai Palace Nightmare Mode. Let's do this, I guess. I don't know. I, don't, I didn't even test how much damage I'm going to do. Oh my goodness. I'm so silly. Why did I do that? <gasps> oh my goodness. Let's just uh, mute that because Kira don't want copyright tricks. Okay. So basically, I'm going to get one shot no matter what. So it's kind of that outrun. Oh no. I'd, why do I do such little damage? Why didn't I? I was silly. I was silly. I thought I may have a chance. Look at this. I can usually like one shot these. I'm doing three million health. What? Okay. Kind of wish I had Earth Clap right now. I didn't realize it was going to be this hard. So, um, well, this is going to be an adventure, sir. So Maybe, maybe I might have some friends help me out, possibly, because look at this damage. No way am I going to be able to do this. So I think I'm going to jump in a call with my friends and we're going to see if we can beat this. Okay, I have my friends here. We are doing a noob dance because that is just what we do. And we are going to actually attempt this because we're all mages actually so this is gonna be actually really interesting oh my goodness i didn't think that'd be available and we're gonna do this can we beat them the first area we may just do we do around 1.5 million each without innervate and we i do around 3.5 million to innovate normally you'll see my health is different because i realized there is no point in having any stat points in the health so we just chucked all 118 
into uh, spell power because that's just, that's just what we do here because it's, you know, cure logic, okay? Cure logic. Okay, so ready? Three, two, one. And let's do this. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We need to at least finish this first off. If we don't finish this, I'm going to like completely have no faith in myself for these types of challenges ever again. Especially because they're only going to get harder from here. Okay, so, okay, okay. I do a bit more damage with these guys. I will say, we're doing a bit more damage than before. Obviously, this is not on hardcore. This is not ever going to be on hardcore. If someone could complete this in hardcore mode, I would give them a major, major props because... I can't do this. You can't do this. And I'm gonna die. And then they're gonna attack me as soon as they come back. Okay, let's lead them out of here. One, two, three, four. It's either we die and lose time from dying or... Okay, it's we complete it or we die trying. There we go. That's what I wanted to say. It didn't even push my E. They're right at spawn. Oh no! They're away from spawn! Okay, let's get away from them. Oh no! Oh no, oh no. Come on, come on, come on. Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Okay, good. I got them away. Okay, whew. As long as I got them away from spawn, it's not that bad, I guess. I mean, there's some still at spawn, but I don't even want to risk doing that again. No! <laughs> come on, Kira, you can be do better at this. You can dodge. Oh, I can't respawn. <gasps> oh my gosh, no, he got the glitch. No! <laughs> Oh, rip. Kefefe. Oh, no. Oh, um. Please don't tell me I just got that glitch, too. Okay. Oh, I was so... No, if I got that glitch, I would have rage quit. I cannot rage quit at this. We can attempt this. We can at least get through the first ones. Maybe with 6 minutes and 48 seconds left. Can we? Possibly. Maybe. More than likely, no. Are we gonna try? Yes. Are we gonna die trying? Yes. Do we do this for content every single time? Yes. <laughs> I would love a new dungeon to come out tonight, but I'm just not sure if that's actually going to be a possibility. I don't know if they have been working super hard or not. Oh my goodness. I can dodge. I can do this. I just... <sighs> I blame it on the fact that I haven't played DQ in like properly in like a long time because... If you didn't know, um, I kind of stopped playing for like a week because I've been playing other games like Fantastic Frontier and stuff. Obviously, like it's not really gameplay that I would record personally, so I haven't recorded it. It's just been more of a thing that I've just enjoyed playing with my friends. Obviously, I get bored a lot of the times and I've been watching anime and Harry Potter and the, all the best stuff in the world, obviously. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm a weird kid. You should... Well, I'm not even really kidding. I'm an adult. Guys, I'm an adult. Can I just say hashtag adult life right now? Because <laughs> realizing that I just paid for like my entire America trip by myself, that dedication. Why did I not push innovate first? Oh, well. Oh, well. Kira, you need to learn to evaluate your life better sometimes. But welcome to Kira Rambles Aimlessly for like 10, 20 minutes while she attempts to complete a dungeon and not get hit by these guys. Because Henry and I are trying to like circle at the same time. Come on, they are so close. We've at least gotten a third. A third. And then, oh my god, there's those ones over there too. No! Can I do this in four minutes? Will I go crazy? What is going to happen? I have no idea anymore, but I am just accepting of it, and that's just what's going to happen. Okay, okay, Henry should do it. No. Okay, mine? Will mine do it? And, okay, <gasps> three left. It says three or four or five. Oh, gosh. One, two, three, minimum. Okay. We can do this. We have three minutes and 44 seconds. We can do this, right? I believe in us. Do you believe in us? 
why are you taunt oh he's trying to get them in a group <laughs> i see i don't have like any of my spells anymore i kind of moved them over to my second account and i just haven't logged into it since uh that was my placeholder basically for everything because i didn't want to crowd my inventory obviously i could put it back in my inventory now like all of the legendaries it's just no point personally to do that i could but welcome to kira being lazy I mean, my organization is on point at home. I can be so organized, but then having stuff clutter my inventory if I can't sort it, that's annoying for me. Just a little heads up, but come on. The, these guys are just under halfway. We have two minutes left. If we don't beat this, I'm trying it again. I don't care what people say. I will be doing this again until I can... D oh, man. Why are we so terrible at dodging? I don't want to get the glitch like Kefefe because there's no way we are going to win if we're glitched. I always get the glitches. Every time I play these types of games, I always find a new glitch or a new bug and it just happens to me, I swear. It's like bugs search out for me or games are just coded to be like, hey, this is Kira, have fun. She needs to not play this properly. So here's a bug and make her rage even more. Fun fact, if you didn't notice, those little gray things up here, uh, they're actually the spawn cubes for the enemies. I didn't notice that until last time I was like going through the map when I was spectating. I was like, oh, what are those? And then I realized that was the spawn markers for the dungeon. Never seen them in any other dungeon before, so that was really, really cool to see. But wait, 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 did we do it? Hold on. With one minute to spare? Oh, thanks, Henry. Make it under a minute, why don't you? And there we go. We put it past the first area. Oh my gosh, first area is past. I have faith in us. We can totally complete this within 46 seconds, right, guys? I have complete faith that we are going to win this. 100%. And that is me being sarcastic if you didn't realize that already. Because that's about to go down 10 seconds. It's going to be around 15 seconds. Come on. Henry died. Oh, that's like 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And time is up. That wasn't the worst run I have ever done actually I have done a lot worse and I probably will do a lot worse that starter one challenge there mm, no I was so shocked that the starter ones work but it's actually really really funny to see how the um oh what's the call it like the mechanics are actually working for the armor and the weapons like you cannot use with one without the other like i honestly thought i would do a lot more damage like i go around 200 million damage with everything with innervate and now i do 3.6 mil obviously my armor gives a lot because it gives like 11,000. so let's see what would my helmet just give me a lot if i was just to wear a helmet 190 million see just the helmet alone gives me something and that's ancestral um and then how much would my my just my chest go for okay 111 okay so basically the same so they're basically very very balanced armor and so all together obviously my main loadout is going to be completely different but uh let's just oh i just realized this is with full health oh ah, 220 okay i need to reset my stats at some point because i'll probably forget that next time i play this but um yeah that was the challenge for today. If you guys want to see other challenges like this before the new dungeon comes out, obviously I will be posting when the leaks come out for the dungeon, like the logo, screenshots, the theme, everything of that sort of nature. So make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you guys are brand new to the channel. Also hit the notification bell if you want to be notified every single time I post a video or start a stream or post any leaks because... I find out everything when I wake up in the morning and I have to record a video on it or I'm usually awake when it comes out and that's just perfect and yes, I stay up until 3 o'clock in the morning for you guys when updates happen so I can live stream it then and there, but um, yeah, be notified for that because we are going to have so much fun when the next dungeon comes out or whatever they add actually, I have no idea if it's actually going to be a dungeon or not, but um, yeah. Thank you so much to the people on the screen right now for being my current channel members. You guys are amazing. And if you want to learn how, want to, learn how to become a channel member, just click the join button down below or on my main channel page. And I hope you guys have a lovely day or night, wherever you guys may be in the world. And I will see you guys in the next video or a stream. Bye, guys. I can turn back into a beach girl now. 
hold on, hold on. Before we end, bitch girl mode activated. Okay, bye guys.